Click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, I welcome you all to this video. We are with chapter 6 of Microwave Engineering. In the previous video, we have solved problem 1 based on to the high electron mobility transistors. So in this video, we are going to take the next problem, problem 2. Before that, in the family of microwave bipolar transistors after the BJT, we have addressed the heterojunction BJT, JPET, metal semiconductor field defect transistor and now this high electron mobility transistors. So let us begin with the problem. So here the problem statement for high electron mobility transistor HEMT is given to us. HEMT has the following parameters denoted by VTH is equal to 0.13 volts, ND is equal to 2 into 10 raise to power 24 per meter cube, psi suffix MS is equal to 0.8 volts, E suffix GG is equal to 1.43 volts, E suffix GA is equal to 1.80 volts, epsilon suffix R is equal to 4.43. We are asked to make computations for the determination of conduction band age difference between the gallium arsenide and aluminium gallium arsenide. Whereas in the part B, we need the sensitivity of the HEMT. So let us first of all identify the given six parameters. So the very first parameter given to us as per the problem statement is represented as VTH. So VTH is nothing but the threshold voltage. So I mention threshold voltage with the given value 0 0.13 volts here. Whereas the second value is of a concentration denoted by ND. So D for donor it is. So I write it is the donor concentration. The donor concentration ND holds the value 2 into 10 raise to the power 24 per meter cube here. Next to the second parameter we have the representation by psi. So the psi accounts for the metal to the semiconductor short key barrier potential. So this potential represented by psi is equal to 0 0.8 volts here. Whereas the next parameter given as capital E suffix GG is nothing but the gallium arsenide band gap. So this value is 1.43 volts whereas next value is represented as E suffix GA. It is also the band gap but it is for aluminium gallium arsenide. So this band gap has the value 1.80 volts and the last parameter is the dielectric constant relative one that it is 4.43. So here after identification of the given details we start for computation of the conduction band age difference between the two materials gallium arsenide and aluminium gallium arsenide for the given HEMT high electron mobility transistors. Now here the conduction band difference for the part A can be denoted by delta capital E and it is the difference of capital E suffix GA minus capital E suffix GG. So substituting the given values it becomes 1.80 minus 1.43. So the value is 0 0.37 volts here. 
so i outline this particular value for conduction band energy difference i can give the suffix c to it so after determination of the conduction band age difference for the two materials into the given device we require to determine the sensitivity of the device now the sensitivity of the device is denoted by a ratio so the ratio is of i provide for part b the sensitivity by differential of vth with the differential of length and it can be computed by the formulation here we have minus in the square bracket the square bracket is to be put under square root we have 2 into q into nd into we have the parenthesis inside that it is psi suffix we have ms minus delta ec minus vth the parenthesis get completed and this is divided by the epsilon and the square bracket under square root here so we can substitute the values here we start with minus inside the square bracket 2 as it is q is replaced by 1.6 into 10 raised to the power minus 19 nd is replaced by 2 into 10 raised to the power 24 in multiplication 2 here we have the parenthesis inside the psi suffix ms this is equal to 0 0.80 minus the delta ec that is obtained as 0 0.37 minus vth is provided to us that it is 0 0.13 the parentheses are completed and it is divided by epsilon so it is the complete dielectric constant so it will be 8.8 854 into 10 raised to the power minus 12 into the relative value provided to us that it is 4.43 so we complete the square bracket and put it under square root so the computation simplifies the sensitivity to the next step as minus here we have 0. 4 9 into 10 raised to power 4 divided by 10 raised to power minus 12 to the power 1 by 2 as it is and we get it to the value minus 70 into 10 raised to power minus 3 so we get it to the form volts per nanometer here finally the sensitivity for the device is denoted as dvth divided by simply d also the mod is represented the magnitude after taking a mod will be simply 70 millivolts per nanometer so i outline the required value here so here we are completed with the answers for part a and b in the next lecture we shall be dealing with the topic metal oxide semiconductor field effect transistors for microwave application use i hope you are definitely getting the knowledge of microwave engineering very well for more details and the knowledge you can subscribe to ekda channel thank you